Burn Britain has issued an apology after she warned Buckingham Palace and No. 10 to beware after Sri Lankan protesters set fire to the Prime Minister's home. Burn Britain, 64, has apologized after she was branded irresponsible for tweeting that Buckingham Palace and 10 Downing Street should beware after the home of Sri Lankan Prime Minister Renil Wickremesinghe was set on fire by protesters. Protesters stormed the country's capital due to a lack of food. Fuel and medicine. The shortage has caused prices to soar and inflation has hit 30%. As the news broke on Saturday, Fern tweeted in view of her 115,000 followers, Sri Lankans have stormed the presidential palace in Colombo. This is the result of a shortage of water, fuel and food. Who can blame them? Number 10 and Buckingham Palace beware. The tweet divided users, and many took to the comments to blast Fern's choice of words. Andy said, can't decide if your tweet is pointless or irresponsible. Chris replied, both. While Sarah stated, We don't have a shortage of water, fuel, and food. It's just to bl asterisk 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 why expensive. An hour later, Fern issued an apology and clarified her comments. She pinned, I apologize. I didn't mean that we should similarly storm public buildings. What I do mean is that with grim predictions of men, women, children unable to afford to eat or heat this winter, need to be tackled right now. Sick. Plenty of the presenter's followers rallied behind her and offered their words of support. Michelle wrote, I knew what you meant Fern, and I expect the majority did. My blood boils at the unfairness of aspects of our country, it's a human right to eat, and feel warm and just feel that you are valued. 